hello everyone welcome back so in this video I'm going to show you how to enable external sharing for teams let's go into office 365 go to admin center click on teams and Skype So when you turn on external sharing, you want to allow guests, which is the people that are outside of organizations, you want them to be able to to access your team's uh, team site. So to turn on external sharing, let's go into organizations wide settings, external access external access you want to make sure you enable this is on and you want to make sure user can communicate with external user this is on as well this two item must be on and if you want to block or allow a certain domain you can enter that here just say if you want to block um cnn.com so any user from cnn will be blocked so and if you don't set up any domain everyone else outside of your organization should be able to access your team site and guest enable You want to enable guest, allow guest access. This has to be on. Calls, manage calls, specific control for guest users. You want this on. So these are uh, settings for guests. Meeting, turn on, turn on or turn off guests for meetings. If you want to allow guests to join the meeting, this is where you set. Screen sharing, single, day, disable, or entire screen. Allow meeting, allow meet now. This is on. Here's some more setting on guest messaging. Edits and messages is on. Guest can delete messages is on. Chat is on. So all the options here are on by default. And if you don't like any of these features and you want to turn it off, you can just turn it off click save the next one is team settings so this is the team settings email integrations so this video just cover the external or guest sharing or guest allow um, external guests to, to join your teams only so the only two items you need to configure is the external access and guest access all right so that's it thank you for watching and have a good day